orb we'll have the bob orb and the bob orb's perfect a little bit more bang for our buck yeah that, that felt like that felt like some pretty good bang for our buck Hey everybody, how's it going? Clue Shots here, back with another Peglin Suggest. This one is from Common Turtle, saying, build a tank. And um, they give me a, a list of things to add to this build, and they said I could tweak it however I wanted, so I did tweak it just a little bit. So let's go ahead and go really quickly go over all the relics. We got Bombaton. It's all the bomb relics and a couple of healing ones. It adds gunpowder, short fuse, improved catalyst, bombulate, recombomulator, powder collector, um, perfected reactants smoke bot i did consider this a bomb relic because it does affect bombs and what what it does the um alchemist cookbook we got an apple a day wall chicken and the cake and now i know what you guys are thinking you guys are probably thinking oh well actually there's a couple other um uh bomb relics such as the super the sapper sack and you're absolutely correct. That is absolutely entirely true. And I will not even deny that in the slightest. And you're probably wondering why I have a stone. So let's go and talk about a couple of these things really quick as we um, continue this run right now. Uh, what's it called? So what I decided to do is I decided to play on Crucible 10 because Crucible 10 had a lot of, um, a lot of fun things about it like uh bosses have more health and all that stuff all that good stuff and i really just wanted to show off how strong i believe bombs are so that's exactly why we're playing on something a little bit more challenging um anyways hope you guys are having a fantastic day if you guys aren't hopefully it turns around for you every day is a new day so let's go and get stuff rolling all right let's go and launch it over here that's also why i have a stone like i said um that's gonna be something i'm gonna have to just work on getting rid of because obviously you know stones are stones and they're gonna be problematic i'm gonna go ahead and upgrade this little guy here and uh, direction here doesn't really matter too much but i don't really want to go straight down so i'm gonna go left here if i can and then uh, i do have an option to go into a shop or going down here i'm not really gonna worry about shops or anything like that there's a couple there's a couple relics that i wouldn't mind grabbing that being said i'm not really that um i don't really care that much about them so not really too much to worry about uh what's it called a couple of the relics that i didn't grab that i could have grabbed uh, that would have totally fit the bill just fine uh, would be stuff like the uh, um, grinding monstera because that technically increases my health over time so it makes me even more tanky but um i figured that was something i could get along the build instead of uh um, starting off with it and anything else that i end up coming across here would also be good I think that would be I think that's a pretty nice one there and uh, I don't have that many coins because I'm trying my best to grab um I'm trying my best to grab as many coins as I can but I have a lot of orbs to upgrade as well so that's why I don't really have that many <laughs> and as you can see we're kind of uh as much as we're grabbing we're also upgrading our orbs so anyways anyways so far so good um we have just two more orbs to fully max out so i'm not really gonna worry about that we're gonna go to the right here and then yeah wow lots of this is like almost like a uh a normal default peglin run because of uh because of how i'm playing it right now which is really cool i like it i think it's pretty neat pretty nifty um anyways hope you guys are enjoying your day having a great day and if you guys haven't had some water something to stay hydrated i highly recommend it um, I think I've said that already, but hey, you know what? Sometimes uh, when I get caught up in other things, I don't say the things I want to say. So uh, I'm just double checking. That being said, um, we are definitely on our way, guys. Uh, I knew that was coming. I knew it was coming. We got all the coins on that stage, by the way. Just going to put it out there really quick. This is a really good spot to like just roll it on the side here, but equally, we're not grabbing too many extra bombs. Um, I kind of wish there was a way to like almost upgrade relics like i think certain relics would be really cool if you could upgrade them and i think the uh, powder collector would be really cool for that because if you imagine right imagine a powder collector powder collector would be really cool to upgrade and be like oh it takes half as many um pegs to turn bombs into into pegs and whatnot i think that'd be really cool echo chamber sounds nice it doesn't really give us too much damage though because we're not really doing that much damage with our actual orbs so we'll see what happens oh okay i got a little bit lucky there 
I didn't go the wrong way. If I'd gone the wrong way, I wouldn't have been able to get as much as I have here. I also got rid of the um, Peglin intuition because I did, you know, this did say build. So I figured the tank build all by itself would be would be this. We can get a, a free relic here. So we're gonna go and grab a free relic. Ah, navigation inflation, not too bad. Straight left down into two more relics. Like I said, we're getting quite the, uh, oh my gosh. That's amazing. We got rid of our stone orb, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And there's a grinding monster. I, you know, I wish I could script things and just be like, yo, here's what's going on. Because this is all literally like the perfect items. So like I said, I wish I could script it and just be like, yeah, this is literally just perfection. Um, but I can't. And if I could, this, this, this is probably better than I could have imagined. <laughs> this is really amazing. Um, wow. So, I mean, like, this guy's gonna give us health. We're gonna, we're gonna get so much health from all the different things. It's gonna be fantastic. And, like I said, this is Crucible 10. Um, I kind of want to try some other things. Okay, Salt Jigger's gonna be amazing because that's just gonna increase our health even more. So, yeah. Oh, oofa doofa. I was hoping to get more coins with that. I'm surprised the uh, explosion radius isn't bigger. That's all good. Is he dead? No, he's not dead. Okay, that's fine. He's definitely dead now, though. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, he's dead now. All right. Interesting. So I actually, I would say, unfortunately, didn't get the uh, super, the sapper sack, which is totally fine. I'm actually going to grab the Matroshka shell right now. Um, more orbs means more refreshes more bombs more everything more goodies in general so definitely works out really nicely in that capacity i'm not really worried about dealing damage to be honest um anything works and everything is fine i'm really surprised that they haven't put a limit on the bob orb as to how many um bombs it can detonate really surprised by that fact that being said i'm not really like upset about it um, so I could go right because there's a shop there, but I think I can just get a shop down here somewhere. So I'll go left because left does have two guarantees and one's an elite fight. And I'm not actually sure just yet if at elite fights you can grab, uh, I mean, sorry, at shops, if you can grab the same uh, relics as you can, uh, you as uh, you would at like an elite fight. So I'm not really like too upset about it, too perturbed. Yeah, these guys are going to be rolled pretty well because of exactly that. Um, I, would have, I might have a lot of audio fixing to do because um, when the bombs go off like that and it has like a big fizzle sound, uh, I'll be 100% honest, I think it actually messes up the audio a little bit. So we'll, we'll see what happens. If you guys suddenly hear some weird, weird stuff and I missed it, um, well, I'm sorry. That being said, uh, I'm gonna go and tell you guys a little bit about my day if you guys are interested or about like just uh, my time, my my time recently. So my weekend was really good in the sense that um, I didn't really do a whole heck of a lot. I didn't um, play things. I didn't play things to record or anything specifically. I kind of uh, had a lot of that stuff pre-recorded um, pre and whatnot. So uh, that was really nice because it kind of like gave me a break from my typical routine. That being said, oh, wow, that was, that was good. Yep, 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 yep. That being said, oh, sorry, my brain. Every every single time I see something, I'm like, piece of candy. Um, <laughs> oh my, okay. Uh, let's go. So that all being said, um, there's a lot of things that are, you know, pretty interesting. And uh, one of the things that I'm doing right now that I think is pretty interesting is right now I am... Oh, we're not doing damage with that. How do we get 33 damage? Wait, I'm actually really confused. How do we get 33 damage if we're doing zero? I'm just not going to worry about it. Yeah, it's not going to worry about it. Um, anyways, so one of the things I've been doing recently is I've been trying to figure out um, how to uh, how to program... Well... How to write a game i don't know how to write games so trying to figure that out and trying to trying to you know work it out in my brain so i can see how that how that would work and um what ends up what ends up happening right now is uh, there's not really like a quote unquote good way to write games because i don't know how to program well refill software stone means a lot of money 
that's gonna be fantastic i think um well these are both literally the exact same i'll let it decide for me i'm just gonna launch it into some bombs and wherever it goes it goes <laughs> there you go so deep left is uh probably what we're gonna do grab yan sure and we do get a free relic here so i'm gonna go and do this bada bing bada boom Alrighty, refreshive that's really interesting all right deep left we go because that is where we want to go um i did want to do that that was the important one uh but yeah so for the longest time i've always wanted to write games and uh, program games and whatnot and uh right now i i kind of have like a good opportunity to do that because uh, i no longer need to know how to program per se i do have some skill some knowledge in the matter and uh, that's honestly kind of all i need because uh, uh if you guys don't know there's a lot of ai tools out there now and certain ai tools are basically allowing me to uh oh this could be really good could be really good Ooh. nice not too bad not too bad Alrighty, <laughs> cool yeah certain ai tools are basically allowing me to uh, write oh i know how i'm doing damage uh yeah they're, they're allowing me to uh, to write code and then basically just edit it and change it to uh, fit my needs i'm gonna go and heal here because yeah just i'm not full health so i just want to be full health there we go this is actually really good i'm getting a lot of extra coins there honestly i don't see why i need to now that i think about it but let's go and grab everything because damage uh peglinero's pendant pocket sand is sure why not you know um super boots is really nice because it actually gives me health um post battle so i don't have to heal and then molten gold i mean that's just extra damage at this point and there's no orbs that i need to remove so we're all good and set ready to go um i don't really need to toss this guy to be honest so i'm just gonna go and skip him and we'll skip one more orb right after this because once we skip this next orb We'll have the Bob Orb, and the Bob Orb's perfect for getting a bunch of bombs. Just as such. But yeah, so basically what I'm doing right now is instead of writing code, I'm basically just having AI more or less write the code for me. Wow, it's a little bit unfortunate that this came to be the way it is. I'm going to get the gift that keeps on giving. It's the best op opportunity to have as many bombs as possible. And yeah, we're good. Yeah, so I'm basically letting AI write the code for me, and then I just adjust it and tweak it and put it on the things I need to. This is also probably the fastest way I can think of to, uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, to learn, to learn how to make a game because, uh, how I learn is I learn kind of by doing in addition to other, other things. And this is really, really good. Um, sure. I'll take everything. I mean, well done steak is going to be great. Ask me anything works really well because if our final boss is, uh, He's, it's not the super sapper uh, or the peg sweeper. Ambidection is great. And Spiral Slayer, eh, I mean, any damage is fine. I'm gonna probably always going to have a crit, so it's not that amazing. We'll go left and try to grab the two elite fights there. And then I guess we'll try to dive right. So left, 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 and then dive right if at all possible. Unless this happens, in which case we go right, and then we're just gonna have to dive left to the dive right again. A <laughs> little bit of mysteries. A little bit of mysteries going on. There we go. But anyways, yeah, so that's kind of how my weekend has gone is um, you know, I've spent a lot of time trying to write uh well trying to figure out stuff. Right now, I feel very accomplished because in about a week's worth of time, I have gotten I've gotten to the point where I have uh, written a movement system for the characters. I have, uh, ooh, change mirror. We're just going to remove one of these orbs because we don't want to remove everything. So now we just have one of every orb, which is pretty nice, to be honest. I might go the wrong way here because bombs and all sorts of silliness. There you go. We're fine. We're fine. Fine. Nothing to even worry about. Ooh, ooh, this could be really interesting. Um... It might work well, it might not. I don't think it's going to work too fantastically because we don't have the... We don't have a... Oh, wait. Okay, lots of questions. Why was... Why was this peg... Why are things going through that peg? Ah, uh, I can't remember. Anyways, it's fine. It's fine. Not going to worry about it. Not going to worry about it. Uh, it stopped refreshing. We already refreshed. Wow, we already refreshed 10 times. That's uh, pretty impressive. 
Probably because we had two orbs. Um, yeah, probably because we had two orbs. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Anyways, I, like I said, I feel ra rather accomplished because uh, over like almost a week's worth of time, I got a character moving, got them so they don't infinitely jump. You know, it's just a single jump every time they, uh, every time they do their thing. I want to go left if I can, but I don't know if I'll be able to. Okay, I was able to go left. I won't even question it. Oh, same fight times two. We're gonna go for this one first because I think we're gonna get more uh, bang for our buck with this guy here. A little bit more bang for our buck. Yeah, that, that felt like that felt like some pretty good bang for our buck. This is quite the tank build, I would I would argue, especially with the or with the uh, relics we've gotten so far. Our health has just been shooting up. Refreshing punch would be amazing. Uh, duplication potion would also be pretty stellar. We went the wrong way. No, that would have been triple elite fights. Wow, actually, I didn't realize it would have been triple. That would have been um, insane. That would have actually been pretty insane. Okay, this is going to work beautifully. I mean, we're going to do tons of damage. But yeah, I also got an inventory system, and uh, I made it so you can pick up items. So like I said, I feel, I feel pretty accomplished because of that. Uh, it's not perfect, of course, but comparatively, I mean, it feels nice. Okay, well, I'm at least going more or less the right direction here. Let's go ahead and get the extra item. Wow, we almost didn't get that extra item. <laughs> okay, then. Strange Brew, thank you very much. Um, we're going to go left here. This is going to give us two more relics. This is an impressive amount of relics, considering we've only gone to, like, one shop. Uh, definitely start off with this orb. There we go. Honestly, like, there's a lot of things that could make this insane. Um, I just hope that it keeps on refreshing the board and then getting bounced upwards. So we're getting as many bombs as possible. However, we are losing out eventually because uh, as we go through this, uh, one of the things that happens is duplication potion. Thank you very much. Uh, one of the things that happens is uh, as we go through the board, um, until we get to our next orb, the bombs don't actually respawn for this orb. So if you notice, there's a bomb on this corner that should be respawning, but it isn't respawning, even with the refreshes. And that's just um, how they mitigate insanity. <laughs> and that's just how they mitigate craziness, crazy builds, which is totally fine. I think it's uh, um, understandable. So that's all good. There's a decoy orb. Let's see what we got here. Uh, dash through the flames. Yeah, we're gonna keep it alive. There we go. All right, we're gonna launch it kind of as much as we can straight in the middle. That worked out really nicely. Okay, yeah. And he's dead here. Thirteen thousand damage. Let's put it out there. Okay. I mean, I didn't even need it. I kind of want to do the criticris because I feel like the criticris could go really insanely. So. I'll do that. Wow. Uh, I didn't realize our health was as low as it is. That's totally fine, though. Uh, I have two to skip, so I'm going to go and skip two. And I'm just going to go straight in here. Oh, the game just lagged hard. I don't know if you guys saw that. The game was like, yeah, I don't know how I feel about this. 69. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help myself. Oh, man. All right. If I could skip that orb. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to I'm just going to do it anyways. Um, did I need to hit something? Oh, I don't know. It's not that important. I mean, I say it's not that important. It's important. It's important, all right. Uh, let's go, like, right in here, maybe. I don't know. Well, we'll just let it do its thing. I was hoping I could... I was trying to, like, figure out a way to, like, make it work and hit them all and all sorts of stuff, but I don't want to accidentally die by letting things happen, so we're just gonna go in here. There we go. There we go. Okay. And that's it. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to comment, subscribe. That was a fun build. It was silly, wild, and all sorts of greatness. I'm glad I didn't get the Sapper Sack, though, because it would just been atrocious to see myself die every single, every 10 seconds, or only go after a single bomb. Um, anyways, catch you guys in the next one. Peace out, everybody, and adios.